Lopez Foods has been around for 15 years. Uh, however, that company has been supplying McDonald's for over 30 years. Uh, and we supply Canadian bacon, we supply uh, breakfast sausage patties, and we supply uh, beef patties. And the number one focus here is quality of the product. Well, quality is from uh, where it really starts, where the product starts, whether it's the pen, you know, the transportation, uh, the temperature that it, the product is kept at, the different uh, beef cuts that we use, quality, safety, uh, inspections that we do every hour on every product and it goes all the way down so it's from quality is it is my responsibility all the way down to the person who's you know sweeping the floors or cleaning the walls or anything it's everybody's job one every night we have a crew of uh, sanitation personnel that come in we have a team of approximately 50 people that are responsible for cleaning this facility uh, at the end of production, usually around 11.30 to midnight, uh, the sanitation crew will come in and they literally disassemble all of the processing equipment in each of our different processing areas. They then bring high pressure hoses out, they use soaps and sanitizers and literally clean uh, the entire facility from top to bottom. All of the equipment now has been inspected by our quality assurance department and has passed all of the pre-operation checks before we go into production. Each truckload of beef or truckload of pork that we receive contains approximately 40,000 pounds. The material comes in large cardboard boxes with liners that contain approximately 2,000 pounds of material. We're looking for several critical things. We're gonna check the temperature of the product. We're gonna check the age of the product. And if all of that meets within the acceptable ranges, we go ahead and receive it into our inventory. When we receive that product, we assign each bin of raw materials a unique identification number that stays with it throughout the entire process. And that gives us complete traceability. Uh, we know exactly when the product was received. We know when it got transferred to our refrigerated warehouse. And we also know when it went to the processing floor and we used it to start either producing hamburger patties with or we start making sausage patties. McDonald's uses 100% USDA inspected beef, snow fillers, snow extenders to make their hamburger patties with. The product is all USDA inspected as is. Our facility is inspected by the United States Department of Agriculture. We're transferring it up into large mixers where we're gonna chill it down using CO2 to get it down to a temperature of approximately 28 to 30 degrees Fahrenheit, which is the perfect temperature for forming hamburger patties. As you can see, we've got uh, freshly ground beef that's just come through our initial grinder, and it's getting ready to be transferred up into our initial blender. Behind me, you can see the beef coming through a final grinder, and we're transferring that into large stainless steel tubs and then we're gonna transport it over to our forming machines where we'll stamp them out into either uh, McDonald's regular hamburger patties, which we use on the Big Mac, or the cheeseburger, or the double cheeseburger, or we'll turn it into uh, the world famous quarter pounder also. And we'll take a look at each of those patties as they come out of the forming machine. The freshly ground beef has now been transferred into our forming machine, and we're now stamping it out. And what we see here are quarter pounder patties coming right out of the forming machine. This product is about 32 degrees, and so we need to freeze it, and we're gonna run it through a large impingement freezer, which will take roughly two minutes, and it'll take the product from 32 degrees Fahrenheit down to zero degrees Fahrenheit in that period of time. Here we have the frozen patties a short two minutes later coming out of the freezer at zero degrees Fahrenheit. The patties are now passing underneath a metal detector and then dropping into an automated stacking machine that presents the patties to the uh, operators and they're gonna take them, place them into a cart and then we're gonna seal them up and get ready to ship them to the McDonald's restaurants. Each one of these boxes represent a customer. In each one of these boxes, either four to one or 10 to ones, 120 customers in a four to one box. That's the patty count. 
uh, 384 uh, plus or minus four in a 10 to one box. That's how many customers each box is, uh, is, is connecting with. And we have to make sure that those customers are safe, that they receive the highest quality, and that they, they get everything they need from our customer, which is McDonald's. Quality for low fast foods is a, is a big part of what we do here. Uh, everyone's engaged in um, improving the quality of our product, ensuring that it's always meeting the standards that McDonald's has set. And it, I think it's really paid off for us. You can see it from anyone in the company, from the guy packing the patties to the top executive. Uh, it's just a big part of what we do here. You know, I think what makes us special is the family atmosphere that we all have here in, in the company. And again, from management all the way down to the production workers, we work together to achieve that goal of supplying McDonald's quality.